Freshly made soup, usually the best. However, chicken to Campbell's soup can be a nice appetizer, wouldn't you agree? Yes, I guess so. Hmm. Hasn't done anything, has he? No, just been sleeping, I think. Or laying there, either or. Yeah. You know, typically I'm the last one that leaves this place before the skeleton crew comes in. Yeah, just... Why are you still here? Your shift was up like an hour ago. Yeah, I just thought I'd spend more time here, I guess. If that's okay. I don't mind. It usually gets a bit lonely here anyways. I can so, imagine. So, honestly, it's up to you. Yeah. I'll just finish these reports then. <laughs> Cats. Yeah? You're not writing any reports. Just looking over them. Without making the whole wheel noise thing? The wheel noise thing? <clears throat> yes, on, on the uh, mouse, the, the scroll wheel noise. Oh, okay. Um, I mean, just, yeah. <clears throat> Is something the matter? If, 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 you, if you missed the bus, I can just give you a ride back and come back here. I, I'd like a ride, yeah. Let's go. Um, not now, though. Just, uh, Why not? Just, uh, when you're done with work, obviously, you know? I don't want to disrupt. I, s I more or less sit here and play with- I, I sit there and, and play card games until it's time to go. Well, um, we, we don't have to do it yet, just, um, whenever, you know? Well, we can do it now, then. No, no, like, like, later. Like, you know, when the skeleton crew comes in, just to make sure. Don't want to leave him on, you know, unsupervised, yeah, right? What's the matter? I didn't really want to talk about it, but... Hey, are you alright? No, I'm really not. Hey, what's, what, what's wrong? What's wrong? I'm really scared, Dr. Harkman. I can't walk home tonight. What happened? The letters keep coming, and they've gotten a lot worse. They've been talking about what I what I look like when I'm in the bath, and my bath's on the second floor, so I'm not sure how they can watch. But they've been talking about what I look like, and talking about seeing me in my in my room, and and all these other things. And I'm really scared. I don't want to walk, and then I don't I don't want to go anywhere. So I I didn't want to ask okay, for Pat, Ryan. Cat, cat, cat. Like yourself. Breathe. I'm sorry. No, no, no. Shh, shh, shh. Just breathe. <laughs> Are you better? Yeah. Sorry. I'll drive you home, okay? Thank you. Come on. <sighs> Believe and besides, it's not like he can get anywhere. The glass itself is still bulletproof, so. Yes, I guess. <clears throat> Thank you, Dr. Hartman. It's no problem. Well, um, I'll see you tomorrow, then. Okay. Uh, where are you going? Back in, you know, side. Well, of course, I understand that, but, uh... You're not staying there, are you? I don't really have anywhere else to go, Dr. Hartman. <laughs> and I don't want to impose on anybody, Get so... Get your shit. And get back to the car. Okay, thank you. I'll, I'll be right. I'll be right down. Don't worry. I'll look very intimidating with my glasses. Oh, okay. <laughs> <sighs> okay. Um. That's really nice of you, Doctor Arkman. Okay, I can just grab my shit. Let's see. What do I need? Um, I need my my backpack. I haven't used this since fucking college. All right, grab some clothes, essentials. Um, let's see, I need my toothbrush. Um, I need my face cleanser stuff, just because I, you know, my makeup and everything. Okay. Um, oh yeah, extra shoes. Um, extra other things. Uh, socks. Um. 
Anything else I need here? Nothing mandatory. Uh... Yeah, okay, perfect. Alright. This is so nice of Dr. Herman. I really feel- I- uh, I shouldn't- He's so nice to do this. A cat spines you. Oh, hey. Sorry. It's all right. I was just, uh... You looking around? Yes, I'm just confused as to how somebody could... I've been confused, too, but I uh, didn't really, you know... It's, been it's weird. all right. I'll just head to my place, and uh, you were sleeping on the couch. My back hurts enough as is. Yeah, I figured. <laughs> Thank you very much. There's no problem. Now, I'm going to make sure that nothing bad happens, all right? I doubt anyone followed us. Yeah. I mean, I probably intimidated them off. For sure. Hmm. For my old man appearance. Now, <clears throat> before we head inside and such, I would let you know. It's a bit of a... Well, I'm, I'm over. I don't like doing a lot of stuff. Okay. Like decorating, that was more like my oh, ex-wife's okay. thing. I, okay, I didn't know what that... Okay, yeah, that's fine. Yes. I'm not gonna... Yes, well... Yeah. <clears throat> I understand. Um... He would say, rub your feet off, though. Okay. This is my little home. <clears throat> wow. Hmm? Yeah, just, uh... Very much what? not what I thought it'd be. But kind of, well, I mean, you know. could live in a house. I just don't feel if you see the need to. It's cheaper this way anyways. Yeah, I guess. But like, you know, the whole, I don't know, layout. What? <laughs> the big kitchen. Oh, yes, I do love to cook every now and then. That's cool. I did spend a bit of money on the TV, though. I do like to catch the Sunday sports. No. Yeah, that's that's cool. That's good. It's a nice big TV. Bigger than mine. <laughs> <laughs> and, um, <clears throat> if you need to use the bathroom, it's just over here. Okay. Yeah, is it okay if I go and change for now? Of course. Go ahead. Alright, thank you. Alright. Let me just change. Okay. Um... That's really nice of Dr. Harkman to do. I, I don't know, I should probably, I don't know, say something about it? Should I even give him the full details of what happened? I don't know. Maybe? He could help, probably. Yeah. If he's not busy, that is. She'll get a perfect view of the TV. And... Hey, sorry. Uh. No, it's quite all right. I was just trying to think of what you would like to eat for tonight. Oh, I'm fine with anything. I'm not really picky. Pineapple pizza it is, then, with anchovies. Well, you know I don't like anchovies. Extra anchovies. <laughs> I have hamburger helper if you want that. That sounds good. Um, mm. but, um... The, the letters have been kind of weird. I didn't bring them with me, but, um, you know. How bad are they? I don't really want to get in trouble or anything. Trouble? Why would you get in trouble? Well, the letters have been kind of talking about you and Reggie. What do you mean they've been talking about us? They... they I mean, like, you know, I don't really know how to describe it. It's been, like, really possessive kind of things, saying that whoever's writing it deserves me. And that, I don't know, maybe you're in the way of it? No, 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 no. We need to step step back a little. How do they know about me and Reggie? I mean, Outside of work, we don't talk. Well, you mean, you did come to my house that one time, but I don't know how they well, knew yes, about they Reggie. Well, yes, came to your house, but Re Yes, exactly. And... 
They also mentioned Davis. And a few details. I, I don't talk. You have a phone on you right now. I, I do, yeah. Please. Uh, Give it to me. Sure. <clears throat> I'm just, I have to be certain, all right? Oh, yeah, of course. You haven't texted anyone this, that your mother or father... No, no nobody knows I work at the Foundation. I know what I'm doing, so... We have a security breach, then. I, I know, and I, I thought I'd be in trouble for it, so... Kat, there's no evidence suggesting that you even did that, okay? You're not in trouble. Okay. You're not gonna be able to go back to your house for a couple days. I know. And I'm glad not to. So. The Foundation is more than likely gonna be doing a sweep of the area. Probably getting some public records, checking out what exactly is stalking you. And I'm, I'm not trying to freak you out, but um... No, it, this is very important. I you know. told me. You should have said something sooner. Did you know about this sooner? I did, but one of the letters... You know, my neighbor was killed, right? Yes, I One of my that letters time. that I got said that my stalker killed him, and I was really scared that if I said anything, maybe, I don't know, I, I don't know. I didn't really, you know, know what to do about the whole thing. It's, it's fine, just, <clears throat> we need to plan right now. Yeah. Tomorrow morning, I'm going to be talking to O5. Okay. To let them know that we have a security breach, not from one of our ICPs, but of another individual. Perhaps, did you, you sure didn't like talk about it? It's like just, just in your house or something, just like to yourself. I mean, I mumbled something about you know Davis being ungrateful after you know he took me hostage, but I checked my house for any bugs as well to see if anybody bugged my house, and I didn't not, find anything. Not to be in the house, cat, but. It's you're not really a security expert. I know, but when you join the Foundation, you're given a rundown of what to look out for. Of course, of course. I'm just concerned, I guess. I know, but my house... Shit. I always have... The thing is, the, the camera. I, I never catch anybody on the camera. I was meaning to ask that. You've never seen anybody on the camera. No, it, it for some reason, it just... Besides the old man. Besides the old man, it's just... Like, it's looping constantly because there's nobody walking in front of my house. And I have an alarm system, none of the alarms go off. And it's a really good alarm system, because, you know... Either we're dealing with a very crafty burglar, or if my suspicions are correct... What the likelihood of that is nearly you? Astronomical. What? That's me the first time. Have you ever noticed anything strange in front of the camera? Anything at all? Not not just the looping, just anything at all? Mm -mm. No. Not even a little? Nothing. I mean, like... A, gust of, a random gust of wind, perhaps? Uh, perhaps something that doesn't make any sense? No, like, really nothing weird in front of the camera. It's so high up, so... Can you get into contact with the person that sold that house? I can contact my realtor and see if they can get me back in contact with her, but she's moved out of the country, so... Out of the country? She knew something was wrong then. Yeah, probably. I didn't really think much of it because she said she had to leave for a job opportunity abroad. How much would... That... that <clears throat> you got that house for like a little, a little over a hundred thousand dollars. Yes. Correct? Yes. A house like that would usually go for three to five hundred. I was surprised I offered more, but they just said my first initial offer was fine because they didn't want to wait around to see if it'd be approved. Either way, no, I. Okay. Come with me. Come with me. I need you to sit down for this. Okay? Okay. Now, this isn't the first time something like this has happened. Well, I mean, in your case, it is. However, 
when somebody finds these situations and such. That's not the first time. Now, I, I know researchers who have dealt with anomalies such as something similar, where something in their life just seems completely off. Mm -hmm. Do you think this... Perhaps we are dealing with an anomaly that may capture the Foundation's interests. Do you understand what I'm saying? I mean, I think. But... I don't know. Um, it could be an anomaly, but it also could... I mean, I also had the thought that it could be groups of interest. Groups of interest, such as the Chaos Insurgency or the Occult... Maybe to freak me out? Anything. No, they wouldn't do anything to you. If anything, they'd be targeting me. Not to bum you out, but you are a low-level researcher. I am a low-level researcher, but I work with Davis. I have access to his cell. <clears throat> mm -hmm. So... If someone were to find out about Davis, it doesn't matter if they go to you, they could go to Reggie or I. Yes, that's true. But there's no reason to go saying these things about you. Even writing you letters, freaking you out. There's nothing to it. I guess, I just... Even in the Foundation's like point of view, there's no reason to do that. I Because just... they gain nothing from it. I know, I just... I didn't want... I don't... I don't know of any anomaly that... I mean, obviously it might not be a known one, but... It's okay. Well, I don't know if this Just is, like, scared. dangerous or anything to deal with. I understand. And I'm sorry for hiding this from you for a while. I just... No, it's quite alright. I'd be scared, too. Though I'd also be flattered that someone finds me interested at the age of 60, so... <laughs> I just didn't want to worry anyone after the whole thing with what Davis attempted to do. I just. I might need to contact O5 soon now. You think? If it is what I, if it is what you're hypothesizing, then that means that they're going to be targeting you, and i.e. me, and or Noah Reggie. Yeah, because honestly, I thought maybe the camera was also having issues too. No. I had a minor electronics, I know how to set stuff up like that. I know, but then I also looked up the camera to see if anybody else was having these weird glitches that, you know, it just looks like it's looping all the time. And some people had that issue, but, you know, I, I didn't know if it was just, you know, a weird fluke or something, so... I was even going to buy a new camera. And actually set up cameras all over my house to see if I could catch whoever this was. Save the money. Yeah, I guess. I'm gonna go ahead and call 05. I would let your parents know that you are currently not at your home right now. Text them, whatever. Yeah. I'll do that now then. Yes. And again, stay safe, okay? I will. Thank you, Dr. Harkman, for your help. Of course, it's no problem. I can't imagine what... Well... Just, just stay safe. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna just text my parents real quick and... What's this? And... Email my work account ethics committee they want to schedule a call with me soon am I in trouble maybe they already know I'm going to be in huge trouble oh god I don't know what to do nope I'm I'll... I'll call 
call them now. Let me just, um, go to the bathroom, so in case Dr. Ruckman calls. Comes in, at least. Alright. Oh, that's fast. Hello? Is this, uh, is this Kat? Yes, it, yes it is. Hello, this is the Ethics Committee. Calling from the Foundation. Um, hello, uh, what, what can I help you with? We've taken note of some recent activities within the files and such. And such as how you've been acting towards the uh, SCP Notice 5162. The only reason we're calling today is to ask how 5162 is being treated. Um, treated how, like, privileges or, um, cell-wise? In general. Well, after, um, he attempted to, um, uh, allow 096 to, um, escape from containment, um, the, the Dr. Harkman and the O5 Council have, uh, basically removed all of its privileges, such as, uh, the kitchen, the table, the chairs, um, bathroom. the bathroom is gone as well. They just have a bed and a table and chair. And uh, they don't have the selection of clothes they have anymore. They have a uniform for an SCP. I don't feel comfortable with this setup, as I believe the SCP should at least have a toilet and a shower at the very least. Even if they attempted to... Um, release something like that on the facility. But, um, it is out of my control to, to do that. As an ethics committee member myself, I can guarantee that all of us at the board find the lack of respect for 5162 appalling, and as well as his living conditions. I as well, but... I'm also aware of the danger he poses to... He poses danger, however, he is not a wizard that can kill us all. I agree. I believe the bulletproof glass is enough to, um, deal with him, but I don't think perhaps he should be treated as such. But, um, I don't know if anything I say could be done about that. Are you interested in remedying the situation? With 5162, it won't be me handling it. I was reformed up the chain of command. Will my report be anonymous at the very least, so Dr. Harkman does not know it is I who said anything? Your report shall remain anonymous. Great. Um. Is, is that all? Or is there anything else you'd like to know about the SCP's living arrangements. I believe that'll be everything for now. Alright. Thank you for calling. No. Thank you for upholding our humanity. Of course. I try to. Goodbye. Okay. Um, I'll just hang out until Dr. Arkman returns.